Joe Murphy, morning manager and personal trainer for the Stevens Fitness Center. We want to take a look at another version of a Peck Fly machine. There are a couple of adjustments that you need to make. First of all is a seat adjustment. You want to adjust the seat so that when you're in the sitting position and you're performing the movement, your arm is approximately shoulder height, slightly below shoulder level. The next adjustment that you need to make prior to performing the movement is the range of motion adjustment. Set the range of motion to a point that you're able to grab the handles that are perpendicular to the floor and you'll feel a slight stretch at the chest muscle and at the interior delt, front part of the shoulder. Keep your back against the pad. Slight bend only at the elbows. Bringing the hands together. Think of trying to either hug a big bear or putting your arms around a big barrel. Chest up, back straight. Working that chest muscle. Avoid banging the weights when you come back to the starting position. Avoid using the biceps and bringing the hands together. Keep the arms out straight. Again, only a slight bend at the elbow. Okay. For those of you that have any issues with your shoulder, you might find uh, that using the inside handle will be very helpful for you. That will reduce the stress on the shoulder and still work the chest muscle at the same time. But you might have to adjust the seat just a little bit to properly align your, your arms with the shoulder joint. This has been a presentation of the Stevens Fitness Center. Thank you for watching.